dispersion of light. So, what is dispersion of light? First of all, see the definition. The dispersion of light is like this. Well, li white light is passing through a prism. It is splitting into its constituent colors. What is its constituent colors? What is the prism? Let us understand. Prism is nothing but a rectangular glass lab in which two surfaces are inclined to each other. And when the white light is passing through this glass prism, we get a salmon color, a band of salmon color. And this band of salmon color is nothing but a spectrum of light. Now let us understand the cause of dispersion of light. Before understanding the cause, first of all see one thing that a white light is made up from different wavelengths of light. These, the speed of these wavelengths of light is same in vacuum. So when these light is entered to the glass prism, each wavelength experience different diversion or we can say that each wavelength experience different refractive index. A higher value of wavelength experience less refractive index and a lower value of wavelength experience more refractive index. When the wavelength of light is more, it means for that light refractive index is less. If refractive index is less, then deviation is less for that light. On the vice versa, if the wavelength is less, then refractive index is more. And if the refractive index value is more, then deviation for that light is more. In this case, red deviate least and violet deviate most. It means red is having higher wavelength and violet is having lower wavelength. Attention to this experiment, we have a recombination of the spectrum of light. In this experiment, when white light is passed from the prism, we get salmon colors. And now this salmon color again pass from the inverted prism and we get a white light again. It means a white light disperses into salmon color and when we combine this salmon color, we get a white light.